But when I heard this verse in Ecclesiastes 7, I was like, man, that's just, I mean, this is just a great nugget of wisdom in the scripture that just is exactly what I'm talking about here with not having to deal with everything everyone says. Look at verse number 21 in Ecclesiastes 7. The Bible reads, And take no heed unto all words that are spoken. Right? He's not saying take no heed to any words that are spoken. He says take no heed unto all words that are spoken. Like you don't need to just listen to everything that everyone says. Take no heed unto all words that are spoken, lest thou hear thy servant curse thee. He's saying, you know what? If you just try and listen in on everything that everybody's saying, you may find someone, you know, you hear someone saying something bad about you. Because guess what? It's going to happen. Because people talk about other people, and that doesn't mean it's right, but I'm just saying, people do it. And if you just want to make sure that you can hear everything that everyone's saying, well, you know what? You're going to hear some things you don't want to hear. And you're going to hear some things that it's just better off that you don't hear. Because it's, it's, it, it's not going to change anything at all, and it's not going to mean anything to, to have to hear everything that people are saying. You say, you know what? It's just better not to know that he says in verse 22 then, For oftentimes also thine own heart knoweth that thou thyself likewise hast cursed others. He's saying, you know what? If you just listen to everything people are saying all the time, you're going to end up hearing people talking bad about you. And guess what? You talk bad about other people too. He said, you know yourself that you've done it. So why do you want to just sit there and listen to everything that everyone's saying just so you can hear something that someone said bad about you? It's like, look, you've done it too. Let it go. Don't worry about it. Don't fret yourself over that type of stuff because it's only going to cause problems. Okay? And we have enough problems in life in general just trying to do what's right. We don't need to get ourselves into more things and find out more drama and dig up more things that people are doing. Just leave it alone. He says in verse 23, and I love this verse too, all this have I proved by wisdom. See, I've tested it. I proved it by wisdom. I said I will be wise, but it was far from me. Right, so it's not always the easiest thing to do, but this is true, and this is wise, and this is the way that we ought to be. You know, you don't have to deal with everything that everybody says. Leave it alone. And especially, I think, now more than ever is this passage just seems to be more relevant. Like, it's always relevant. I mean, obviously it was when this was penned down. You know, people have a tendency to want to know, you know eavesdrop or know what's going on and what are my servants saying about me? What are people saying about me? Don't worry about it. Focus on just doing what's right and don't worry and be concerned with what everyone thinks. But these days, you know, imagine if this is being put in the Bible before all of the digital media and everything that exists today, like this was important then, how much more so now? And the reason why I say it is because it's, it, it's, it used to be hard, like when, without all of the digital stuff, it's kind of harder to know what everybody's saying, right? It's harder to do the eavesdropping. But when you have all this technology, I mean, you've got emails, text messages, you know, videos, all kinds of stuff, social media stuff that just never goes away. I mean, you can literally just find, I mean, if you really want, you can invest probably all of your time just digging around, trolling, hiding, trying to find what is everyone saying about me or whatever. And you know what I'm going to tell you? It's going to be a waste of your time. You may find people who talk bad about you, but you know what? That's not going to do anything but just cause problems. And you know, if people are talking bad about other people, shame on them. But it's not going to do you any good to find out who's talking smack about you. 